At first sight, the night sky is made up of thousands of stars arranged randomly. But when you look closer, some stars are more visible than others. They're brighter. These stars were recorded very early on in history. The Babylonians grouped them into 12 constellations. The constellations of the zodiac. If you observe the sky long enough, the stars appear to move around an imaginary axis running through the North Pole. Did Paleolithic man observe this phenomenon, picking out groups of stars, and then mentally project the images of familiar animals onto underground walls? Back in Lascaux, Chantal believes that the cave might be far more than a gallery of 600-odd paintings. The very shape of this dome reminds her of the belt of the zodiac in the sky. One figure, a large bull to her right, draws her attention. She recognizes the Pleiades star cluster and the Aldebaran star. She decides to measure the astronomical coordinates of various points on the animals. Eyes, tips of tusks, lower back, and front and back feet. Next, she turns to astronomy software to test out her theory. J'ai vu que l'ensemble I realized that the sun passed through all of the constellations. You have the unicorn, which would represent Capricorn, and horses in the place of Sagittarius. If the hall of the bulls were in glass, you would see the constellations behind them. 